guys welcome back to my channel so today I have a summer haul for you guys I have beauty and fashion items in this haul I didn't want to like separate it and do like a beauty haul and a fashion haul so I just put it all together because it wasn't enough for it both at least in my opinion it wasn't enough so I'm just gonna go ahead and get started because you guys know I can ramble on and on about nothing so we're just gonna go ahead and get started the first item I actually ordered it off of eBay and they are these pigments I'll link in the description box exactly where I got them from like the actual link for these but they're really pretty um they have like six colors I guess I ordered a 12 pack but you can't order like a 6 pack or whatever and they're really pretty colors and they have like almost every color and they are pigments so you can like use them for multiple things but I'm probably just going to use them for eyeshadows and stuff like that yeah. um, I went to like a beauty supply store I don't like know the name of it I think it's beauty stop beauty shop beauty something it's one of those like Chinese hair stores like the hair stores they have the weave at the back of the store I went in there looking for a conditioner but they didn't have like a conditioner for the type that I use in my hair so I um, just picked up some beauty products while I was in there and I just picked up Nika K products because that's like the only place where I can get Nika K products and I just picked up two lip pencils and one is in nude it's in nude and this is what it looks like and the other one is in pink sachet and it looks like this um, and then I picked up an eye pencil in hazel and it looks like that I picked up two lip products from her um, Nika K and they are my school colors black and gold I didn't even realize that but um, I picked up a black one and I'm not really one to like swatch my hand in the store so um, I was looking for like a matte black lipstick and then I came across this one and it was only a dollar so I really wasn't expecting it to be like the best lipstick but it's like a glossy lip and I don't really like that but I mean you can build it up and make it work or whatever so that's what I'm going to do and like I say they're only a dollar so I can't complain and then the next one was actually the wrong color that I picked up I was looking for a yellow and I actually picked up gold but it turns out this one was really really pretty on my lips so I really like that one and this one is right here if you guys can see that and like I said all of this the lip pencils and the lip liners were a dollar so moving on to the drugstore products um, I picked up a Vivid in Shocking Coral and it looks like this I was really excited when I got this because I never had a coral lipstick before and if you guys watch my May favorites if not I'll link it in this video but I actually have this in my favorites and I know you probably wonder how can you put something that you just bought like two weeks ago in your May favorites but I really loved it like I fell in love with it so I was like I'm gonna put this in my favorites because I love it and it's like so pretty I picked up a Rimmel London Stay Matte um, Press Powder and transparent and if I'm not mistaken I could be wrong but I think transparent and translucent it's the same thing it actually shows up like it's like clear so um like it doesn't have color so that's why I picked it up to set my concealer I picked up an elf hefty glow bronzer and this one is in sun kiss and I'm looking for like the perfect bronzer to contour with and this is not it this is more of a glowing bronzer so but I like it. I really do. Um, I picked up the CoverGirl Clean Whipped Cream Foundation in 20. And this is what it looks like. I actually have it on my face today. And I love it. The thing about this powder is that you have to wear a powder with it. Because if you don't, you're going to start like getting shiny and like greasy in your T-zone. If you wear it with the powder, it's like fine. So um, that's the only thing about this powder that I don't like. That you have to wear it with a powder. But it's fine. It's really pretty and I have it on today with my uh, Revlon Nearly Naked. Then the last beauty product that I picked up is color, a Maybelline Color Tattoo in Back to the Bronx. And this is what it looks like. I love these um, little things. What are they called? Cream shadows. That's what they're called. I love these cream shadows because they're like really good for like days when you don't really want to put on a lot of like eyeshadow. So you can just like 
put a little bit on and put it on and they're good for like an eyeshadow base so i really love those those are all of the beauty products i have so let's move on to fashion so i went on my girls my annual girls trip with all of like my aunts and my grandma and my great grandma and my mom and all of that and we went to north carolina this year normally every memorial day weekend we just pick a location and we go for the weekend and this year we went to north carolina so um every time i go to north carolina i always go to papaya because there's not any in south carolina near me so if there are any in south carolina you guys know let me know because i've never seen one in south carolina i picked up this shirt and it looks like this I love it. I think that it's so cute. It's really, really bright and neon. I don't know if the camera is like really picking up how neon it is, but it's really, really pretty. And it has like a um, print on the front, and then the same print is on the back and lace. So I really like that about it. And um, of course, you do have to wear like a tank top or a bandeau. I really love it. And you guys know I'm like obsessed with California, and I can't wait to move there. And then. The next thing I picked up is just this crochet top and it looks like this and I've been looking for like a crochet top um, for a while now and then when I found this one I was like so excited and then it has like I think this is lace like a fishnet lace I don't really know <laughs> um, but it has that like on the chest area up here I guess so your scraps or something won't show. I love this top and it's supposed to be a crop top. But I guess I bought it too big and it's not really cropped on me. But I love it. I think that it is so adorable and cute and so me. The next store I went to is New York & Company. They had a 50% off of everything in the store sale. So I just picked up some shorts. And uh, my mom actually got me these shorts. And they look like this. They are um, yellow and they're like mid-rise shorts. But I bought them too big so... Um, they're like high waisted on me, but it's okay because, um, like I said, my mom bought them. She really don't like for my shorts to be like too short or something like that. So I um, so she made sure I got like a bigger size or whatever. And they're high waisted on me, and I really love them because they're my favorite color. And I think, and then this next top I got from Forever Twenty One in North Carolina. So um, it's just this top black and white um top it is like really really baggy it's like a baggy tank and it's very very low on the side but i do have to wear a bandeau with it and i think that it's really really cute especially for the summertime so yeah so the next items also come from forever 21 but they come from the forever 21 back home so and i just have two items from there and my sister is like really mad because I bought the shirt because she wanted it because she loves boss and um, I just picked it up. I thought that she could wear it, but she's not one to wear someone else's clothes. So, but it looks like this. I'm thinking about giving it to her, but don't tell her. But I'm thinking about giving it to her, and it says boss, and it's just a crop top, and I really love it. I think that it is so cute and baggy, and it's just it's cute. This last item is actually something that i've been wanting for a while and i actually seen miss makeup miss megan's makeup yeah miss megan's makeup and beauty baby 44 haul when they did the pack sun kendall and kylie um haul and they actually had a skirt similar to this and i've been wanting a skirt like this but i just couldn't find it anywhere and then none of the pack suns around me sell kendall and kylie i don't know why but none of them sell their um collection so <laughs> I um I couldn't find it anywhere and I just didn't want to order it off online because it was like forty five dollars and I was just like I don't want to pay that much for a skirt so I went and I looked in Forever Twenty One and I found one similar for half the price so um this is what it looks like and it is a fox leather um circle skirt <laughs> and I couldn't think of the name fox leather circle skirt and I think that it is so cute. So neat and it has a zipper on the back and I just I just cannot wait to wear it I'm like really really in love with this skirt so I will be styling some of these items in a lookbook coming up if you guys want to see like reviews or have any questions about it be sure to leave it in the comment below if you guys want to show me some of the items that you have picked up recently then be sure to leave it in the video as much below because I want to see them I want to see what you guys are getting um, be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to my channel if you're not already i hope you guys are enjoying the rest of your day 
night or whatever time you are watching this. I hope you enjoy it and I'm about to go. So, <laughs> bye guys. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.